hello my beautiful people welcome back to my channel how are you all doing hope you guys are doing great please if you're new to this channel kindly click on that subscribe button turn on your post notification bell to be notified whenever i post any video and please if you love this video thank you so much and for all my returning subscribers thank you so much god bless you it might nothing without you thank you and i really do appreciate and i want to say a very big thank you to all those who reached out to me saying Ima, what's wrong why haven't you been posting for quite some time now yes okay so i'll be like have you stopped doing youtube or what i said no your girl is in youtube full time she's going nowhere okay it's just that i've not been feeling well okay but i'm fine now and i thank you all who reached out to me thank you so much and may god bless you all Okay, I really want to address an issue. I really want to talk about an issue. I might not have, have control over this issue, but I know that talking about it and people also watching it might lend their voices out. And I think that with this, there can be a starting solution to this problem. Okay, um, I really want to talk about this issue. My heart is broken. My heart is really pained. Okay, and it's because of the issue that's been going on in this country, in our country, Nigeria. Oh my goodness a lot has been going on a lot of killing this country is no longer safe where are we going to this is our country our only country if our only country should become unsafe like this then where are we going to where goodness god as a this this pain it pains my heart so much and it makes my heart to bleed anytime i think about it anytime i go to the internet to the social media and i see things going on i'm scared i'll be like god god you really need to intervene god you really need to help us in this country what's actually going on okay i actually want to talk about the issue first of all the security people that was killed okay in Imo state okay the Kaduna man and his wife on their way to um to to go for their uh, marriage okay with their mom and their daughter these people were held back by a non men and they were killed in emo states imagine the lady the girl the mom was killed in her presence i can't put up this all these videos here i can't put up all the pictures here because of youtube rules and guidelines i can't put it up. i can't put up because it might implicate my channel so seriously as an i i don't know i was like how can i unseen this video i could have made this video for a long time but because i'm not feeling too well that's why i did I've, I've not made this video and i was like what's going on what's going on this lady was disgraced embarrassed jesus she was beheaded her husband was beheaded oh my god i don't know what's going on okay i don't actually know what's going on okay to to to, to the deborah that was killed in sokoto states that she blasphemed she was stoned to death and burnt jesus i don't know god i don't know i don't know what's going on in this country everywhere is becoming so unsafe everywhere is becoming god where are we going from here where to the one that happened in Anambara State, a lady was killed with God, with her four children. This is this is so terrible. This is scary. No one is safe in this country anymore. Nobody, God, nobody's safe in this country anymore. Hassan, this is scary. You you need to see this. As that even the ones that are happening that social media is not covering. A lot is going on. God, where do we go from here? Ah, where do we go from here? As in, this is about to become a terrible war in Nigeria. It's about to become a terrible And I pray every day and I say, God, please protect Nigeria. Help Nigeria. When will all this come to an end? I know the Bible says that end time will come. Yes, maybe this is a sign of end time. Well, God, protect your children. God, this is scary. I don't even, I don't even know what to say. As in, sometimes, every day, I'm scared to go to the internet. I'm scared to go to social media. I'm really scared. To the guy, Oscar Brown, that was poisoned by his best friend on TikTok. Jesus. What is this world turning into? what is this world turning into i i i i can't really i can't really say i'm really scared 
for, for my relative, for my friends, for the innocent one out there, for myself. I'm really scared because, Jesus, I don't know. I don't even know what to say. I don't know, but this is a heartbreaking thing that every day I want to go out. All my people are going out, my friends. I think about them. I'll be like, God, please bring us home safely. It's a thing of concern. Please bring us home safely. My people are going out. I'm scared. God, bring them home safely. I'm going out. God, please bring me home safely. No one is safe to go out anymore. Jesus. I don't even know what to do. I don't even know what to say because I know that I don't have control over it, but I know that God has control over, over this. And I'm addressing this issue because I want everyone out there, whether you're a Christian, you're a Muslim, please let's pray for Nigeria. Okay, let's pray for Nigeria that God will restore peace to this country. God will restore peace to this country. God will help us in this country because this is about to become a terrible war. The innocent are suffering. Many people are dying. A lot of innocent blood are being wasted. God, a lot of people are being forced to die when it is not even their time. A lot of people die in pain, in agony. Where do we go from here? Where? Jesus, I just pray that God will come and end all those problems in Nigeria. I just pray. And please, if you're a Nigerian out there, please go get your voter's card. Please go get your voter's card because this is this is your only your only signature to choose a president. Your only identity. The only way for you to help so that Nigeria will become a better place. Please go out there. Go get your voter's card. Go, go, go get your voter's card. So that we can, we can, even though we know we don't have control, but we can try as much as we can to vote in a good leader. Please go get your voter's card. I beg you in the name of God. So that we can end all this agony, pain, suffering, hunger in Nigeria, hardship. Please go get your voter's card, okay? And I know that God Almighty in His infinite grace and mercy will help us. He will help us. He will really help us. The way he helped the children of Israel, like, he's going to help us. He's going to come true for us. Please, wherever you are, wherever country you're watching from, please keep on putting Nigeria in your prayer. A lot is happening in this country. A lot of terrible things is happening in this country. We are scared. We are not safe. Nobody is safe. We are scared. Please pray for Nigeria. And I pray that God will help protect us and sustain us, that our blood will not be shed in this country for unnecessary things. I will not die prematurely, but when our time comes, that's when we will go. But we will not, we will not, life will not be forced out of us, okay? Please, pray for Nigeria wherever you are. Keep on praying for Nigeria. And please, stay safe out there. Stay safe out there, okay? Know where it's safe right now. Stay safe out there. And I know that God will come true for us. And let's also extend how to pray for Ukraine. Okay, that God Almighty will help Ukraine too and Russia with whatever is going on, okay? <sighs> At least I'm able to talk about it and I feel relieved a little. I feel relieved because I say a problem half shared is half solved already. So I feel relieved and I know that God will come true for us, okay? Thank you so much for watching and taking out your time, your data to support and to watch me. I really do appreciate God bless you. God bless you. God bless you all. Okay. And please, if you're new to this channel, kindly hit on that red subscribe button. Turn on your post notification bell to be the first to be notified whenever I post any video. Okay. And if you love this video, please kindly give me a thumbs up. Don't forget for Nigeria and your prayers. And don't forget that Ima loves you and she cares about you. Have yourself a wonderful and a beautiful day. Bye bye.